What up YouTube? Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I am Sherry. Thank you so much for being here today. Today I have for you installment number nine of my eyeshadow palette collection. We are nearing the end. Nearing the end, but I still think I might have two or three more videos. So, on my last installment, installment eight, I'll link it for you up there if you haven't seen it yet. Actually, I'll link the playlist of all of them. Go watch all of them. But anyway, I showed my mini controversy palette. I thought, you know, I have a lot of palettes in my collection by people who are controversial, so I kind of figured, I gathered them up and I kind of figured I would do them all in one video. So if people are going to get mad, they can just get mad once. But hopefully you won't get mad. A lot of these people I no longer support or endorse, but these palettes are still part of my collection. Therefore, I'm going to show them to you. So if you would like to hang out with your girl and geek out on some beautiful eyeshadow, then please keep on watching. All right, I think I'll go from like the least controversial to the most controversial. <laughs> How about let's just go for it and I'll just show them to you in the order that they're sitting here. How about that? The first one is Strawberry Dream by Lunar Beauty. This is new to my collection. Let's see. I'm going to do Sweet Dream, Horizon, Cloudy and ooh, this royal blue haze. So we got Sweet Dream Horizon, which is such a cool color. Oh, my goodness. Cloudy and haze. I want to show some more. So we're going to go Ruby Skies, Nightfall, Sunrise, and Strawberry Moon. So, Ruby Skies, Nightfall, Sunrise, whoo, and Strawberry Moon. That chartreuse color right there, good gravy, is that pretty? So that is Strawberry Dream by Lunar Beauty. Next is several Kat Von D palettes. This one is called Lolita. This is new to my collection. Um, this has been taken over by somebody else. So now it's called Vegan KVD Vegan Beauty or something like that. But these are still packaged with Kat Von D. So. Let's see. We're going to do Recuerdos. These are all in Spanish. Hermosara. Um, Lolita. We got to do the namesake. And Torazon. All mats. So this is Recuerdos, Recuerdos, Hermosara, Lolita, and Corazon. I thought it was a T, but it's Corazon. Let me make those look a little bit better.
very pretty rosy tones my cup of tea for sure so this is Lolita by Kat Von D <laughs> next is this giant palette called metal matte matte metal by Kat Von D if you look at it one way it says metal if you turn it over it says matte and it looks like this I was so excited about this I bought one for me and one for Becky and when I got it I hardly ever used it so let's look at what pencil volt and flash these are the metals so watt tinsel twinkle actually volt <laughs> and flash and then some of the mattes I'm going to go with velour moss silk and velvet velour moss silk and velvet I think I missed my favorite one I did it's called a ribbon ribbon And that's a terrible swatch right here. So this is Metal Mats by Kat Bondi. Next is the Shade and Light Eye Palette by Kat Bondi. I don't know if you can tell, but I have used the heck out of this thing. And these have shades oh this is gonna make it hard on me I'm just gonna show them to you this is one of my favorite transition shades let's do one neutral one cool and one warm how about that this is such a nice foundational matte palette any matte that you would need you can get it in this palette I like the way it's set up into quads too and the colors that you'll use the most are the biggest I love that so this is the shade and light eye palette from Kat Von D next is the Saint and Sinner eyeshadow palette oh I wanted this so badly I just love the packaging it's like a stained glass window and so from the saint side let's do worship chalice 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 uh, heaven and rosary So this is Worship, Chalice, Heaven, and Rosary. Oh, Swatch of the Year. And from the center side, Rapture, Devil, vestment and relic so this one is rapture vest no devil 
vestment, and relic. Trying not to blind you. So this is the Shade and Light palette by Kat Von D. And the last from Kat Von D are these Shade and Light quads. I've got three of them. I've got Fawn, Rust, and Plum. And so it's got a base, a, de a defined contour, and highlight section for each one. So this is Plum. So this is Plum. That is the Plum Quad. Shade and Light Plum Quad. Next is, I didn't show you what the front looks like, I don't think. It looks like a little coffin to me. This is the Fawn palette. Can't even see this one. <laughs> that is the Fawn Quad Shade and Light Quad. And this is the rust. This is the Rust Shade and Eye Quad. There was a green one that I never got, but I wish I had. So next I'm going to talk about the Jaclyn Hill palettes that I have here and also Morphe. I'm going to combine them together because Jaclyn Hill and Morphe <laughs> have been problematic. So we'll start with Jaclyn Hill. First I have the Jaclyn Hill. This is from the Vault. And this is Ring the Alarm. All right, I'm going to show you Lolly, Alert, Bomb A S A S, and Framed. So we've got Lolly, Alert, Bomb A, and Framed. So this is the Jaclyn Hill and Mur Morphe Vault Ring the Alarm. Next we have another one from the Vault and this is Bling Boss. And man did I get excited about this one. They were not, they did not live up to what I expected them to be. But I'm going to show you Bling Bling, Jim. Glitz and Glam, and Rockstar. Bling Bling, Gem, Glitz and Glam, and Rockstar.
So this is Bling Boss by Morphe and Jaclyn Hill. Now we've got the Jaclyn Hill and Morphe palette. This is one of my favorite palettes and I still love it even though it's all completely thrashed from me using it so much. I am going to show you Faint Butter Obsessed and Pool Party. So Faint Butter Obsessed and Pool Party. Gotta show you more from this. Just gotta, just gotta. So let's go for Sissy, Jax, Enchanted, and Soda Pop. Really nice fall colors. So, this, ooh, little lady, little lady, <laughs> not little lady, sissy, Jax, enchanted, and soda pop. This is the Jaclyn Hill and Morphe palette. <laughs> so next are the Morphe palettes. This is the, uh, let's see, the 15N Nightmaster. So we're going to do Unique, Va Va Voom, Illustrated, and Cliché. Unique, Va Va Voom, Illustrated, and Cliché. So this is the Morphe Nightmaster palette. Next is the 35K. And it's just a big old palette full of neutrals. Almost all matte. So I'm just going to pick one of the 800 browns. Some that look slightly unique. And we'll go for it. <laughs> that one's kind of cool. This one looks kind of neat too. or not. <laughs> so that is the Morphe 35K. Next is the 35E. They all look the same on the outside so there's no reason for me to keep showing you. Ooh, 35E. This one has some pretty colors in it. I haven't opened these in a really long time. All right, let's go for some kind of bright ones. Hmm. I really thought I was probably gonna declutter all of these, but this one has some really pretty 
colors in it. I haven't opened it in a long time. Let's grab a couple more. I don't think I'll keep the one before this, but I do think I'll keep this one. And this is the 35E, maybe 35 for eclectic. 35E, E for eclectic? I don't know. Next is 35W, and I think that's for warm. I don't know. Some of them are warm. Again, no shade name, so I'm just going to grab ones that my eye are drawn to, my eye is drawn to. Hmm. Not real impressed. Let's try a few more. These look a little better. So this is 35W by Morphe. Next is the 35T. And I think that's for taupe. Oh, we got taupe. We got 8,000 shades of taupe. So, how about this taupe, and that taupe, and that taupe, and that taupe. Taupe, 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 and taupe. How about a couple mats? Exciting business right there. Or not. So that's the 35T by Morphe. And now for the most controversial of all, especially right now, Jeffree Star. So let's start with androgyny. We'll do frosting, deja vu, androgyny, and military. Frosting. Deja vu, androgyny, and military. We'll do charm, fetish, poison, and swallow. Charm, fetish, Poison and Swallow. So this is Androgyny by Jeffree Star. Next is Beauty Killer. All right, we've got Star Power, Prince, Violence and rich B word. Star power, princess, violence, and rich B word. <laughs> 
so sad that you can't talk about a palette without something nasty. Courtney, Expensive, Confession, and Black Rainbow. Courtney, Confession, that's expensive. Courtney, Expensive, Confession, and Black Rainbow. The black rainbow has rainbow glitter in it. You probably can't see it. So that is Beauty Killer by Jeffree Star. All right, next is the Blue Blood. And I'm just going to squ swatch my favorite colors from this. Uh, Cullinan, Crystal Flesh, Blue Blood, ice tray so I'm gonna make little ones Conan crystal flesh blue blood and ice tray then deceased blue Monday flourishing entitled Deceased, Blue Monday, Flourishing, and Entitled. And I'm running out of room, but I'll do a couple more. Ocean Ice, and Undertaker. Ocean Ice and Undertaker. So this is the Blue Blood by Jeffree Star. Okay, for the problematic of all problematics, we've got the Conspiracy Jeffree Star and Shane Dawson problematic. Controversial. The whole nine. So this is the Conspiracy. Again, I'll just choose my favorite shades. Diet Root Beer. Just a Theory. Spiraling. Conspiracy. I'm going to do them little again. Diet Root Beer. Just a Theory. Spiraling. And Conspiracy. We got Pigment, Trisha, Cheese Dust, and Flaming Hot. So, Pigment, Trisha, Cheese Dust, and Flaming Hot. And then, what's the tea? You to tea. Diet Cola, Not a Fact, and Illuminati. So, what's the tea? Diet Cola, Not a Fact, and Illuminati. There's one that I'm missing here. Sleep Paralysis. sleep paralysis. So this is the conspiracy, Jeffree Star and Shane Dawson. All right, stained fingers, stained hand, lots of stained towelettes. That would be the end of this installment of my eyeshadow palette collection. I feel good getting all the controversial people out of the way and I'm quite sure I'll run into some more controversial people before it's all over. But 
Thank you so much for watching. If you missed any of the prior installments, I will link the playlist up there for you. And I hope you enjoyed seeing some more of my eyeshadow palette collection. Thank you for coming and hanging out with your girl. I always love to geek out on makeup with you guys. I hope you enjoyed the swatches and seeing all the palettes, controversial or not. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining me. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. Don't forget to hit that cute little notification bell so that you won't miss any of my videos. I promise the ones after this won't be as controversial. <laughs> but until next time, take care and God bless. Bye guys. So, if you would like to see the rest of my, so this is shade and I like, this is, <laughs> next, 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 um, 99% sure that I should wait to talk until I'm done dusting these. Yep. And finally, the controversy of all controversies, the conspiracy palette, which is J which is James Charles. <sighs> Definitely problematic. Okay, so for the I promise the ones after this won't be so controversial.